Howdy ho guys and gals, welcome back to the Den of Tools. It is Monday, yep, Monday, October 16th, which means it's time for Deals of the Week! Let's jump into it. All right, we got a ton of stuff to go through here. First off, we got the Wild Badger Power Electric Chainsaw. Now, this is a 40-volt chainsaw. Now, if you haven't heard about Wild Badger, I don't know, every time I hear the name Wild Badger, I expect to hear, like, some announcer voice, Wild Badger! I, too much, I know. Anyway, 4-amp uh, hour battery, charger, smart cut. Now, I'd never heard of this company until they reached out to me a few months ago, a lot of back and forth, and... Uh, they actually, they sent me a backpack blower, a gas backpack blower, because you know how much I love gas outdoor power equipment, but we're going to put it to the, to the test and see how it goes. Anyway, I, I just saw this one here. This is their 40-volt chainsaw. I watched some reviews online. It looked like it was decent uh, at 140, 150 bucks. I don't know. Have you heard of this brand? What do you think of them? Anyway, let's keep going here. We got a lot to go through here. I know Prime Days was last week, and we got a lot of great deals for this week. It's stunning. So we have the Louisville Ladder 24-foot extension here, 300-pound heavy-duty. Uh, 300 pounds is the rating, not how much it weighs. Anyway, you're looking at lowest price in 30 days, $210. We got the Wera. You know, I'm a huge fanboy for Wera. Uh, this is the Zyklops Pocket Set 2. Uh, it's got, a, it's basically, it's a ratcheting wrench with bit, uh, bit adapter on it. And it's got a bunch of stuff it can be used with and for $96 on this one. Uh, I know it's, it's, it's there. Some of their stuff is pretty pricey, but oh my gosh, I, I love the wear stuff. Uh, we got also the wear Zyklops metric speed ratchet here, 28 piece set quarter inch drive. It's $111. Uh, and right. This, this was sent to me by a viewer. Found it, it's just the bag, the Ryobi bag. Uh, but it, look at it, it's for 14 bucks and 73 cents. You got some Ryobi stuff or maybe you got some Milwaukee stuff. You don't want to get stolen. There's an idea for you. $14.73. Let's keep going out. We got the Fiskers. Now, this is something I picked up a few years ago. We had a, da a dandelion problem in our yard. And, I mean, just getting down there on your hands and knees, pull pulling these things out just wasn't going to happen. And I went out and I tried this sucker. And, oh, my gosh, this thing is quick. It's fast. It, it's not the most delicate thing out there. It will take out a little bit of a chunk, but it gets the whole root, the whole stem off of there. And it makes it a lot easier. I'm telling you, for $37.32, oh, brother, it's worth it. If you've got weed problems, this will do you right here. All right, let's keep going. The drill brush. I haven't talked about drill brush in a while. It's on sale right now. This is the starter pack. If you have not tried drill brush, this is one of these products that I talk about and I and, and I go on and on and people don't listen. And eventually, and, and I get emails on these all the time, I, uh, on this and, uh, and this kind of category. We need a name for this category, the I told you so category, I guess. Uh, and I'll get an email back going, oh my gosh, I put off, I heard you going on about it. And I just kind of turned tuned you out. And one day I'm like, you know what, I'm going to pull the trigger on this. And it changed my world. That's what these are. These are I told you so changed your world kind of tools. Once you put one a brush like this on your drill, not your impact driver. Your impact driver will just tear these things to pieces. Then on your drill, cleaning your grill, cleaning your tires, cleaning your your uh, your shower, all that kind of stuff. There's there's nothing like it having a powered cleaner like this. You got to try it. All right, let's keep going. We got the S wing bricklayer mason's hammer. I'm always looking for good deals on S wing. Unfortunately, you know, the, the, the core kind of tools, they, they don't often go on sale. But this is a nice, you know, if you're looking for a mason's tool, something like that, you can have some fun with this, $50.50. It's overstock on Amazon right now. This is a great little set here. We got the Knipix, you got the Cobra, and you got the pliers wrench, the two-piece there uh, with the belt pouch. You can see there it goes. These aren't big, but they're great for like an EDC kind of thing or just, you know, small tool use kind of stuff. They're, they're fantastic tools. Fantastic tools. $82, $81.89 on it. Lowest price in 30 days. Let's keep going. We got more wear. We got the craft room. Now, this is just the, the screwdriver. Now, I think I've got, actually, I usually have one right here as I roll away at my desk. I've got this thing. Now, this one, you see, it's got this little ring on it here. Mine's a little bit different. Mine's, mine's got the extension. I don't know if this one extends per se. Let me see what it, it says here. Well, it kind of looks like it does. I don't know. Anyway, 
Uh, still, it, this is just the base unit here, all right? You're not getting any kind of bits or anything else with it, nothing fancy. For $14.60, though, I got to tell you, a lot of people are like, oh, that, the form on that's weird. But you see, when your hand goes onto it, that ridge goes right in there, and it actually feels really good in the hand. At least, I guess, you know, it's it's everyone's tastes are different. I like them. Now, if you need some bits, they got you covered here also. We got the Impact 1-inch bit set here. You can use this with Impact. You can use it in a hand tool. You're coming in at 59.67 on that case right there. All right, let's keep going. We got the Gear Wrench 38-piece drive, six-point mechanics tool set, standard deep SAE metrics, two ratchets, a swivel, two extensions. This is a heck of a set here. This is gonna get your three eighths one and done right there. You're gonna have everything you need in your three eighths. Coming in at 90 bucks. That's 15% off. Of course, Gear Wrench, you know, that's a tool truck alternative brand. They're top end tools. Now this table saw, I've seen this table saw around uh, on, on, on Amazon and other places. And honestly, I've, I've never included it because it just it doesn't seem like super high end. It seems a bit a little wonky, kind of cheap, cheesy, Chinesey, if you know what I'm saying there. Uh, it, it's I mean, there's a lot, a lot of most power tools are made in China these days, but some of them look like they're made in China. This. I don't know. It, it has your standard kind of fence. I, I, I don't know enough about it. If you have one of these, let me know what you think. It's it's an interesting concept because uh, you look at this $300 and there's a $50 off coupon. That makes it $250, which for a budget table saw, rather than one of those little bench top ones that's even smaller and seems more dangerous, you might want to consider that. That said, let's take a look at some of their pictures. Okay, now this one shows you the full size. Of course, it's in metric and stuff. Here we got the max cutting depth. And this dude's pushing on both sides of the saw. Uh, at least on this side, on the bottom one, he seems to be using a push stick. But he's not really. Look at that. Look at the gap up against the fence on that. That, mm, that, that no, I don't think that's the safe way to do that. Man, correct me if I'm wrong. How about this one? This Ooh, mm, and yeah, cringe here, all right? If you're going to do this type of cut, all right, hold on. Let me go to the full screen here. What you need to do is if you got your, your fences over here and you got your, your miter right here and you're sliding this way, you don't keep it up against the fence while doing that because it can get wedged between the blade and the fence, kick back, ding, bad, 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 bad person there. What you do is you, you come back further back, you put a stop block right here, you slide it over, it hits the stop block that's that's then, you know, next to the fence and, and probably clipped on with a, a clamp or something. It hits that, then as it slides forward, it comes off of that and it's free floating on that side. So it's not going to butt up and get pinched and then get you your kickback. This is just all this bad. Anyway, I just had to share that. Let's keep going here. I mean, but at 250 though, it's so kind of tempting. Anyway, Skill saw. Now, during Prime Days, we had the right facing saw for a hundred bucks. Here's, or, or say, left facing. Here's the right facing saw. That's the right way. There we go for seventy nine dollars. A good standard saw. That is a workhorse of a saw. Lasts you all day long. Sidewinder circular saw seventy nine dollars. What that? That's a fabulous. Lasts you the rest of your life kind of saw. All right, Goodyear. We've talked about these air hoses. Again, I saw them in a professional setting. They're not professional grade hoses. All the guys I've seen who've used them, have, you know, it's always like some some cheapskate in the front office bought them because they're like, oh, they're Goodyear. They must be professional. Look how cheap they are. I'll be under budget and get my bonus. Yeah, and it's screwing everyone else over. Anyway, but for the homeowner, for the average weekend warrior, they're just fine. 79, that's 80 bucks is going to get you a quarter inch. Uh, 50 foot front foot for it uh, sorry 50 foot premium commercial commercial line fuzzy backside uh max spring anyway you get the drift it's a, it's a uh it's a polypropylene uh pvc handle uh it, it's an okay it's it, it's all right but look at this we got this real works now i'm not really familiar with them but they're looking at a 3 8 inch 50 foot sbr rubber hose all right that's what you really want a uh, good size now commercial steel construction i don't know about that but for 82 dollars, doesn't seem bad step up if you you get what i'm saying there now let's keep going we got the ego not a lot of ego on sale right now i'm wondering what's going on if they're holding off ego power cs 1804 18 inch 56 volt chainsaw with the 5 amp hour battery and charger included full kit there on sale right now for 346.55 
Uh, by the way, we got uh, the ego snowblowers waiting, ready for that first snow as soon as it happens. I'll be honest, we're we're October 16th. We've yet to, in Montana up here, for the last five years to make it through an October without a significant, I'm talking eight inches or more snowstorm. So still waiting for that to happen. Hopefully it happens before I head off for SEMA. All right. Look at this, this seagull. I know a lot of you are like, why am I looking at pool stuff? Well, people down south and stuff, people with indoor pools, that kind of thing. We did a, a video on this a while back. <clears throat> Excuse me. And, of course, I don't have a pool. I, my buddy works at the local hotel. We went down there and we, we did it on, on the, 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 their pool. And, uh, and it worked great, did what it was supposed to do. And then we got friends who have a house here and a house in Miami. Yes, we hate them. They've, they've got kids who are perfect. Yeah, Lewis, you know I'm talking about you. Anyway, we love you guys. Miss you. Anyway, they're down in Miami. They got a house down there with a pool, and they got a house up here, and they go back and forth. And so I'm like, you know what? Here, why don't you take it for your pool back home? He's like, seriously? Boy, he is tickled pink, loves this thing. He says it works fantastic. They just throw it in there. It writes itself, floats down holds itself to the bottom, holds itself to the walls. It's got little jets there on the back. So it pushes up against the wall, can climb the wall all the way up to the water line, goes around, scoops everything out, puts it in a little basket. Then it comes up to the edge and lets you you know, pull it out. And uh, it, just a great way to clean your pool. $611 seems a bit pricey, a lot, lot, lot uh, cheaper than you know having the pool boy come around every so often. All right, let's keep going. Karcher here, this is my, my favorite of their pressure washers just because of the form factor. I love the setup. I love the on and off with the foot pedal. It's a great setup there. It's a good product for an electric pressure washer. Coming at $97 is unheard of. $97.53 on that one. All right, let's keep going here. Tozo, this I guess should have been in the bonus round. Uh, Tozo NC2. These are active noise-canceling earbuds for $33. This is the one that like nobody knows about yet everyone seems to know about uh forget buying airpods or, or any of that kind of stuff or the bows or whatever noise canceling just fantastic quality for 33 dollars because really there really isn't much to that kind of tech and there's no reason they should be charging two three hundred dollars for these things you know 33 dollars was it 34 dollars call it what it is it's a lightning deal so you got to get it as soon as you can okay uh, and uh, we'll try to upload this, and hopefully you guys can get your, your hands on it, but I don't know. An uh, hour and 48 minutes. We'll see what we can do. All right, we got Armor All. Look at this. You got the Protect Wipes, the Clean Wipes, and the Glass Wipes, all three, normally 20 bucks on sale right now for eleven seventy five. Uh, we got a lot of people said, no, hey, I really like the idea of getting one of those chargers, jump starter kind of things to kind of keep around the shop. Here you go. Here's the go-to one. We got the Craftsman 175 cranking amps, 12-volt manual wheel charger and jump starter there. Great one for the shop or around the garage. $144 on that one. All right, let's keep going here. We got we talked about the X-Tool. And this one, X-Tool, usually they sponsor these kind of videos and stuff like this. And uh, they didn't say anything about it. I just happened to stumble across it. And look at this, you're getting the, the this is the X-Tool Advancer, the very basic one, coming in at $18.99, $18.99. They got the Pro, which has more features and stuff, for just under 40 bucks. Anyway, just stunned that that just happened. I wonder if it was one of those algorithm sales. We got the Weeha plier set here. Coming in here, this is going to be, this is your your uh, your voltage protection kind of safe thing. They're the number one selling, seller in, in North America for insulated hand tools. This thing is, a, it's a 20% uh, claimed on the sale here. 10 left in stock, normally $23. Getting any kind of sale on Weha is a big deal. If you got somebody who's a sparky in your life, maybe needs a, a new set of tools for Christmas, this is the go-to one right here. All right, Mayhew, the Dominator Pry Bar set, made in the USA, lowest price in 30 days. I have the three-piece set. This is the five-piece set for under $100, made in the USA Pry Bar. No-brainer for under $100. All right, uh, now over at Harbor Freight. Now, this one isn't a sale per se, but if you look at it, they're comparing it to the Clutch. The Clutch, that's the one from Northern Tool. It sells for $100. It's essentially the same one, except and so, uh, uh, one of the viewers pointed this out. The titanium table is screwed down to the to the the work surf the work surface is screwed down to the frame. On the clutch, it's spot welded, which means if you get any flex, anything happens, you can't level out the clutch one. This one you can. You can unscrew part. You can tighten it. You can loosen it. You can put shims in. 
it, you uh, you can if you want to put a heavier top or something you can do all sorts of stuff you can fix it this is it's already cheaper the clutch is 200 bucks on sale this thing's 170 dollars at launch seems like a no this is going to be another one it's going to be like that hercules uh bandsaw stand it's going to be one of those where you you got to go and you got to hope that it, it's in stock because it's going to go fast all right we got here over at lowe's now this one this is the dewalt screwdriver if you saw uh, it was a project farm did a whole thing electric screwdrivers and I could have told you from the start and I've said it for years This is by far the best electric screwdriver that's out there and, and his tests show that because of course they are that's I mean That's just it. This is all the HVAC guys. I know have one of these Literally every single one of them and a lot of electricians. I know too. The thing about it is it's gyroscopic it, It's motion controlled. So if you twist it, it goes one way you twist the other way It goes the other way the more you twist it the more it goes it, it's normally $100. It's on sale right now for $69, which is an unheard of price. Here's the thing, out of stock. You can see right there. You're like, well, why are you showing me something that's out of stock? Well, you know, other places that are not out of stock often price match. Home Depot, per se, might be one of them. Anyway, there's lots of other places that sell this. You can show them the Lowe's flyer like, hey, that's the sale price. You know, they may argue that it's on stock. I'm like, that, your match your, doesn't have to say it's in stock. It just has to say that's the listed price. All right, here we go. We're over at Direct Tools. If you don't know, that's the factory outlet for TTI. That's Milwaukee. That's Rigid, uh, Ryobi, Hart. Anyway, they've got their cordless, there's a cordless wet dry vac from Ryobi with a free accessory toolkit. You're getting the two extensions and all this here. And it comes with a battery and a charger. It's on sale right now. 150 bucks now there is shipping when you get from here now if there's a store near you nobody likes you because they don't like to put stores out west i don't know why they hate the west but we don't get stores like this out here all right let's go over to home depot we got the dewalt atomic i think one of the best bang for the buck definitely best bang for the size impact driver going right now you're getting the xr five amp hour battery with it the charger the bag for 200 bucks but on top of that, you're getting a free battery with it. So you come over here, free gift, you click on that, pops up, you're getting a free five amp hour battery. No word on if it's hackable, that's going to be up to you guys to check out. I Again, I don't, we can't follow up on all that kind of stuff. But again, that is a fantastic deal. And if it is hackable, you can return that battery. That's going to be a smoking deal. All right, we got a bunch of Ryobi BOGO batteries as well. In fact, too many to list. I'm just going to cover three of them. We got the planer with dust bag here. Comes with the two amp hour battery free. We got the nailer with two free batteries on that one. And we got the jigsaw with a two amp hour battery free. If you're in Ryobi, you're looking for batteries, time to head over to Home Depot. Kind of a mini uh, Ryobi day sale going on right now. All right, also we got, check this out, the, the Milwaukee cordless angled die grinder here. With the high output battery, that's a that's a nice battery, folks. That's a that's a great battery there. Plus, it's got the standard 2.5 and the charger with it. All of that, 54% off, down to 199 on that one. All right. Also, their deal of the day going on right now is garage storage there from Husky. So if you've been looking to maybe you know build out the garage and do some work in there and really really get it kitted out. This is, this is the time to do it. Again, too many things to go through each one, but I will put a link to all this down below. You can go check it out. All right, now we got some bonus items. We Over at Amazon, we got the Cold Steel Tough Light Folding Knife with Triad Lock and Pocket Clip. Uh, this is it's a nice little knife. Now, they got a bunch of different colors. The different colors are different prices. This one's 31, this is 23, this is 23, this one's 31, and this is 30. I don't know why the different prices, but again, I mean the blue, I like the red, but the blue's fine for 23 bucks. I'll take the blue. All right, let's keep going. We got the sweet crisp. <laughs> what the hell's in the names? Sweet crispy standing desk. Okay, love the standing desk. They're great. This electronic it goes up and down, all sorts of uses for stuff like this. 55 by 24. I use a, a standing desk here. Uh, it's, it's $112, $111.98, $112. That is a ridiculous price on this. Uh, not a super heavy duty desk, but for light duty kind of stuff, it's just fine. All right. We got the third, we're going to do some outdoor cooking. Maybe you're going to be cooking the Christmas, you know, or Thanksgiving turkey and stuff like this. This is a four sensor probe 
Bluetooth straight to your phone, has all the app goodness and everything else you can do with it for 50 bucks. This is it. This is the one you want to get. Now, even with these, you still like to get an instant read thermometer. Thermopro is my go-to. This is a nice solid budget one here coming at $17.59. If you're not cooking with thermom digital thermometers like this, you're cooking blind. That's just the only way I can tell you. I make fantastic steaks and roasts and all sorts of stuff. And I used to think I just couldn't cook. I could never get it right. I got myself some digital thermometers. Suddenly, I am a five-star chef. It's insane. It will fix your cooking. All right. Victoria cast iron sauce pot. Look at this. We got a cast iron sauce pot. It, it's made in America. South America. But that's still America, right? They're made in Colombia. Two quart. Lowest price in 30 days. Nice two quart sauce pot. I like a good sauce pot like this. It was a $14, $15, call it what it is. All right, let's keep going here. We got the AMD Ryzen. Now, I, this is the almost the chip. I have the AMD Ryzen 7 7700X. That's what I'm running in this PC right now. This is a slight step up from that. Heat sink not included. You're getting the that processor, which is just a, a machine, just a monster of a processor. $330 on that one. They, the, I love the, the so much bang for the buck with the Ryzen chips. I'm a huge fan of them. All right, let's keep going here. And last but not least, I have used so many hair trimmers. Now, I I think I was like 30 years old, and I noticed that my hair was receding. And I, I'd always said, if my hair really starts to go, I'm not going to be that guy with that weird balding pattern and stuff. So I took a preemptive strike, and I shaved it all off. I remember I went home from work early. early something happened at work. I can't remember what it was. I it just there was I think there was no work going on or something. We Oh, the power went out. The power went out at work, and I went home. And uh, I was sitting there kind of bored, not going, and I looked in the mirror and I was like, my, my hair is receding. I can't believe, how did I not notice this? And so I started shaving it off and I'm 54 now. So that's 20 some, 24 years of shaving my head. And I've tried all sorts of clippers and stuff and, uh, and, and uh, you know, the kind for shaving your head. And I never liked them, never liked them. And finally I just took my beard trimmer and went to town with it. And, and that's what I've stuck with. And I use the brawn ones. They're fantastic. Comes in a really nice case, a little bifold case. And it's got foam fittings for each of the little pieces that go in there. And you know what? And you can see, I just shaved this morning. Look at that. All right. Clean. You know, save, think how much money you sh you'll you save on shampoo. I say, my wife hates me. She's like, how do you, she's like, you just, you don't ever have any shampoo. I'm like, I don't have any hair, sweetie. And she's like, oh, yeah, I guess not. <laughs> anyway, 50 bucks. This is, a, it, it's with Prime. This, this is, a, it's down 17%. It's, this is the go-to. There's no other choices out there as far as I'm concerned. And it's got the interchangeable heads with it. So you got here uh, a, 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 sh a shaver so you can you can do your regular shaving and stuff with if you like electronic you got your nose hair trimmer if you really want to hurt yourself the little uh little trimmer there you got your different guards and stuff on it it's just a great tool and it just works braun i i wouldn't use anything other than braun at this point I've, I've tried tons of them this is the only one that this just been reliable and always works anyway there you go uh let me know what you thought of prime day last week if you saw our coverage on it there were some great deals there were some really mediocre deals too. I was a little disappointed. Also, if you haven't seen, we had uh, the leak of the uh, the the Harbor Freight Black Friday sale. A lot of people were complaining that it wasn't a good sale. Blah blah blah. They're like, there's only a few good items. Everything else is just so so. That's typical for a Black Friday sale. The idea is it's a baseline sale with a few. Black Friday items thrown in to make it really spicy. And a lot of people don't seem to get that. And, and I mean, five drawer tool carts there for $189. That, that seems like a pretty good Black Friday sale to me. Anyway, go and check it out if you haven't seen it. Again, if, make sure you hit the like button and make sure you subscribe and ring the bell because we're going to all the way through Black Friday on a Christmas and then even after Christmas. We're going to be covering all of that. Now, remember, this is uh, what we got here. We're on 1016 here. The first week, of no last week of this month, first week in November, 30th through the 4th, I'm going to be in Vegas for uh, SEMA. That's the big car show, but also the big tool show down there. All the tool companies are down there, so we're going to go check that out. And then uh, you guys asked for it, so we're going to do it. Uh, first or second week in January, we're going to be at CES. So if there's anything you want specifically for us to see at either of those shows, 
uh, put it down in the comments. We'll read through the comments and we'll try to make sure we include it. Anyway, that's all I got for you today. You all take care. God bless. And as always, shine on.